What's going on, everybody? Uh, long time no see. I got a band box, and uh, I don't do these very often, but um, I got a, I, you know, I always talk to my boy Paul Peep Geek over at Bambox, and I'm like, what's the skinny? Am I, am I going to be down with this box? And um, he's always like, yeah, you know, you might like this or you might like that. But a few things here and there, I've, for the most part, been pretty underwhelmed by Bambox for the last several years, unfortunately. Um, so I just don't do Bambox that much. Uh, I still follow them. I still support them. But I just, um, yeah, it's just never something for me. And I've been trying to cut back on the collecting because uh, he's run out of space. So, but I was talking to Mr. Peep Geek and he said, this has a Superman item in it. Got to get in on it. You're not going to be disappointed. So when my fellow Superman obsessed, uh, pal, Mr. Peep Geek says, Superman, you got to do this. I got to do this. So let's pop it open and seize what we got in store. This was the June box. This um, languished in uh, UPS hell for um, a long time. They said it was delivered and then it wasn't. Um, and then... Uh, it just kept saying, like, out for delivery, out for... Yeah, it was weird. And then it finally showed up, uh, like, last week. And I just haven't had a chance to do it. So this was the June box. Let's get into it. All right. So the only... The only... Um, the only fandom I know is that I do know that there is a Superman item in the box. Other than that, I have no idea what's in this because I do not remember. All right, we got... We got a little uh, pin. This is, I'm almost positive this is She-Ra. Maybe He-Man was in the box. Now that I think about it, maybe He-Man was in the box. She-Ra, dope. This is the, um, this is the good version. Not the, I don't, I'm sure that the new version is fine. I haven't watched it, but this is the classic. And I like that. The new version looks weird. I couldn't get over it. I get it. Like, you know, you don't want it to all look the same. I just never, never really. All right, so the card is Thanos. Again, um, I've talked about this before. Like, the cards are cool, but if you don't get every box, they're kind of pointless. I've got an office card that I never got the mate to that I really liked. And I got um, Harry Potter. I got the Voldemort and I never got the Harry Potter. Uh, I don't display these in any way. I don't have a way to display these. I like the idea. I want to get some of Paul's cards because Paul's an amazing artist and he does that. But I really haven't figured out a way to display them yet. So, like, uh, I'm not... I don't love the cards. I like the idea behind the cards. I love that it's giving artists that opportunity in that small space. But... I don't, I don't, I don't dig the, the, the dual card thing for the simple reason that I don't get the band box every week, every month. If I got band box every month, I might feel different about it. We got the black paper, bam, tradition. All right, let's see. We got more paper. All right. Try not to look. There's always a prop. I think this might be the prop. So let's see what this is. This is... It's a medallion of some sort, and it's got a cat on it. I don't know what this is. I It's not... I don't think it's Thundercats. Um, it's got a Thundercats vibe to it. I don't... But I don't think that's Thundercats. It could be, like, something from, like, one of the newer... Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that is. Um, I'm sure the card will tell me. All right. So far, the pin, cool. The card, eh. The prop, eh. Um, yeah, I don't know what that is. All right. We got a card. Let's see if we won anything. We never win anything, but let's see if we won anything. We won a free autograph Funko Pop. And 
a free BAM Ultra Box, and a free BAM Box. So we didn't come close to winning. We got three completely separate things. Fun, 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 fun. All right. So we got, let's see, this looks like the print. Oh, that's right. There was also a Jurassic Park item in the box. And, um, yeah. Yep, I am happy with that. That is fantastic. Um, I have the pop of Ian Malcolm uh, in this exact position. Uh, I love this. I absolutely love this. I think this might be a variant or um, a... Um, yeah, I think this might be a one-up because it looks like it's out of 2,500. So that might be special. Um, that might be a variant version of it. It's really cool looking. I love this. This is awesome. I'm going to get a frame and put this somewhere. Uh, that's awesome. That's super dope. All right. It looks like there's only one thing left, and it's the autograph. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you see it before I see it. Is it awesome? Is it awesome? Oh, <laughs> this is not a Superman item. This is Superman. This is an autographed Tom Welling, one of our brilliant super Superman fans have been super lucky. We've had, like, five guys play the part, and they've all been brilliant. All of the vocal arts have been brilliant. No controversies. We don't have any Cloonies. Just saying. Uh, in our midst, Henry Cavill, uh, the, the legend, Christopher Reeve, and Mr. Tom Welling. And I like the new guy, Taylor something or other from Superman and Lois. It's a good show. This is awesome. Uh, this is so very cool. Mr. Tom Welling, uh, Superman himself. I have an autograph from Superman. Um, that is dope. Those are, those two items alone just made this box awesome. This is like when Bam hits it out of the box, they hit it out of the box. So yeah, uh, featured celebrity Tom Welling, known for small bill, draft day in the fog. That is super super cool Tom was not wrong or Paul was not wrong this was a dope box all right let's see what we got all right so we got the little spoiler card just to go over everything um, we got the celebrity autograph oh actually this is a one-up this is a um, yeah other people got one which was like gray in the background and mine is the color yellow and red. That's super cool. So this is a one of whatever, whatever, whatever. It doesn't specifically say. Um, this is the regular print, I guess. Um, I guess they're just doing smaller amounts. I, I always thought that they were out of 5,000. Um, this is the regular print, and this was by Brian Meathy. Uh, this is great. I love this. Good job, Brian. Uh, the card, the artist card, was by Othello. He does sign the back. I didn't mention that earlier. Um, the Mad Titan Thanos. Um, I don't know if last month's box had his compadre. I'm guessing probably Iron Man. I don't know. Um, it doesn't say... Oh, this says continues our villain series... Oh, that's right, yeah, because they've been doing heroes and villains. So, like, you had The Office, you had, um, or Cyclops, and then you had, uh, Jim's character from Threat Level Midnight. Oh, my God, the name, blanking on the name. Uh, I never got that one. And then you had Harry and Voldemort. You had, um, I think there was a Batman and Joker. I have... Wonder Woman and Cheetah. I think I have Cheetah, but not Wonder Woman. And I don't know what the other ones were. So there was a... I think there is a hero that goes along with this one in one of the other boxes. And then, yes, this is She-Ra. Uh, this is very cool. Maybe She-Ra was the... Because it looks like... 
It looks like Hordak is the variant, the level up. So yeah, very cool. And then the prop, the necklace, is from The Witcher. I didn't. I haven't watched that. Um, but that's cool. It's it's a it's a it's a cool looking. I mean, it's not my thing, but it's not it's not super cheap looking. Um, it's a decent weight to it. The chain is kind of cheap looking, um, but the the medallion itself really it really is. And it's cheap, but it doesn't look super cheap. Um, but right here, right freaking here. These are both going into frames. I can't say that I've ever gotten a band box where both the print and the autograph were something where I was like, okay, usually I'm, I'm geeking out over the, the, the prop. I think I've got, like on my shelf right now, I've got the Darth Vader bookmark. Um, that's an OG uh, band box uh, item. Um, I've got the Stranger Things bat minus the, the nails because I have a cat around here somewhere who is right there. Let's see, I have a cat. I was not going to fly. Uh, and I have the Gotham badge, the uh, uh, Commissioner Gordon's badge. Um, I think that's it for like band box stuff that I've got showing in my apartment. I also have a Jurassic Park sign that I keep on my fridge. I put a magnet on it. It was a tin sign, put a magnet on it. So, very cool. But I love these. I absolutely love these. Uh, these are going to go in frames, and these are going to go up in the apartment um, for sure. Because as you can see, i got lots of my stuff. It's, it's just, it's just going to blend right in. It's just going to blend right in. Mr. Tom, though, is a, is a gem in the collection because he is, in fact... Superman. So, very cool. Next month's uh, themes for July, I did not subscribe to. I could not tell you what they are. Um, uh, unfortunately, they also did a, a comic box, which looks really cool. It's a little on the pricey side, so I'm kind of hesitant to jump into that one um, blind. Uh, that one's like 75 bucks, and it's cool because you, you get a graded... Um, comic book um, and like a bunch of other comics and that's awesome I love that idea but I don't collect comics as much anymore so I'd be very hesitant to to spend $75 on something that I might not be super into uh, and then they've got the anime box they've got the horror box uh, as they've had for years and I think they've got a gamer box too I think that's and then they've got like monthly boxes I support BAM. I appreciate what they do. I don't always get their boxes because I just, it's just not for me. I don't, I don't find a lot of the things interesting out of this box. The She-Ra pin's cool. I know somebody who loves She-Ra that I'll give this to. Uh, the card, again, people are doing the cards. Y'all got to figure this out. These are cool. People like these. These are affordable, neat, personalized art, but there is no good way as I've seen yet to like really display these in a cool way so y'all gotta get on it card people Mr. Paul if you're watching I don't know if you're gonna watch this you're a busy man but uh yeah you gotta you gotta figure this out you gotta figure out a way to show these and make these important so that we want to get them and display them because I want to like I'm about it I'm I'm going to get one of Paul's at some point anyways just because I freaking love Paul. He's an amazing human being. Go over to Peep Geek. Subscribe to his stuff. Buy some of his cards. His his art is great. Um, I'm going to get one at some point as well. But like I said, I, I want to display it. I don't want it to have it. I'm not buying it to support him for no reason. I want to support him and put it up and display it and be proud of it because to me, these are these are somebody's art. This is This is something that somebody has worked really hard on. And um, I think that's super cool. And I want to, like, give it the respect it deserves. Um, and I, I, there's just no way at this point, like, to really display them well. So, sketch card, folks. Loving what you're doing, but you got to figure it out. you got to figure it out. Maybe you have. If you have, and I, don't, I just don't know it yet, fill me in. Hit it up in the... 
And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. So yeah, I'm not doing the next band box. Uh, I did do uh, the um, I did the 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 winter um, DC World's Finest Collection box. That box was trash. I hated it. I didn't. I did a video on it. And I was like, I didn't say anything nice about. I said nice things about one of the items. It was the shirt. It was a Batman shirt. Super dope. Only thing in the box that I didn't kind of hate a little bit. Um, so I just didn't post that video because I'm not going to be super negative about stuff. But I didn't didn't subscribe to the Summer Box. I'm going to kind of wait and see. They released the first item. Spoiler alert, if you don't want to know. The first item is like a salt and pepper shaker of two people from D.C., um, you can see it on their Instagram page. They released, I think, another spoiler, like, fairly recently. But, I don't know. I don't know if I'll subscribe to that box. I don't know when I'll do a band box again. Um, so, who knows when I'll see you next time. But, uh, I'll do it at some point. Well, you know. You know, every once in a while, bam, knock it out of the park. Again, bam. Super cool. Love these. I actually really like this one. The variant was blue and yellow for that. Um, that would have been cool too. I would have loved that. Um, maybe I'll see if I can get my hands on a blue and yellow one and display them both. Um, cause that would be kind of cool, but I love this. I love this so much. Tom Welling. Um, all right, I'm gonna shut up now cause I'm just gonna gush about how much I love Mr. Tom Welling. Um, cause he's Superman. I got a Superman. He's signed. I got an autograph from Superman. No big deal. No big deal. It's just, just the Man of Steel. NBD. You know, see you next time.